You may be wondering what extra magic hour is at Disneyland Paris. So in this video, I'm going to give you my top five reasons why you should get up early to use that extra hour. You can get access to extra magic hour if you're either staying on site with one of the Disneyland Paris hotels or have a certain annual pass. Extra Magic Hour gives you access to both parks for one hour before general day ticket holder guests are allowed into either park, meaning that the crowds are going to be super quiet. Using that Extra Magic Hour means you can get on the extremely popular rides within that first hour with a wait time of less than about five or 10 minutes. So for example, Peter Pan's Flight, which is an extremely popular ride in Fantasyland, usually sees wait times of around one and a half hours to two hours every day. But during Extra Magic Hour, we got on back in May in less than five minutes, which is pretty much just a walk on. There's also one character that you can meet during Extra Magic Hour, and that's Stitch on Main Street. In the queue to meet Stitch is only going to be about a 10 or 15 minute wait as he is still a popular character to meet even during Extra Magic Hour, when his queue during the day can reach up to 90 minutes. And it's always lovely to meet Stitch when you're in the parks. Even during Extra Magic Hour, you are still going to be greeted by the main mouse himself standing up on the train station stop above the main entrance to the park. If you walk in and then turn immediately around to look up at the train, Mickey Mouse will be there to greet you himself. So you're not going to miss out on being greeted by Mickey Mouse first thing in the morning. He gets up early too. The main entrance queues to get into the main park and the studios will also be incredibly lower compared to what they are if you were to head in for when the park opens to the main general public. A good tip is to get there for about 20 minutes prior to the gate opening for Extra Magic Hour just to get to the front of that queue. So as you walk into the park, you'll have no one in front of you on Main Street and be able to grab the extra special picture of Sleeping Beauty's castle with no one on Main Street. If you have any questions about Extra Magic Hour, please drop them in the comments below as I'd love to help. If you did find this video useful, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up and please consider subscribing and I'll see you again soon.